Hello YouTube, how's it going? I hope everyone is staying blessed and staying focused. Staying focused on positivity, staying focused on good things. Just taking your mind to a beautiful place. Your head, all in your head, a beautiful place. Beautiful places you've never been. Just explore and think more positive and happy thoughts. But this video is about fathers. Um, I did not do a video on Father's Day because I didn't really have the time. You know, life gets busy sometimes. I don't just do the YouTube thing. So life gets busy for everyone sometimes, you know? <laughs> but anyway, and um, every day is Father's Day if you're a good father. Every day is Father's Day. So I salute the men out there that is doing all they can for their children, for their wife, and being a provider of their household and doing all that they can and thinking about other people besides just yourself. The people in their house, they're thinking about them. See, sometimes people want to get the credit on Father's Day, but not really being the father that they're supposed to be. And this is not being judgmental in any way. This is actually me trying to help you guys. Um, children don't forget. So if you're not spending time with your children and you're not doing things with your children and taking them out and showing them a good time and treating their mother right or the person that you are with right setting a good role model and positive role model in their life don't want to try to take the credit on father's day make sure you're doing that with your children because kids don't forget and they look up to you so make sure you have something for them to look up to just want to say that and throw that in there and I want to also say, I had three people who were supposed to be fathers in my life. The first one, don't really want to get into talking about him too much. He was the person who um, helped make me, and that's all he was. Very crazy. Didn't really hear too many good things about him. And I know that God wants you to forgive everybody. And... It's a hard pill to swallow knowing that I have to forgive this person one day and everybody got to pass away and I'm hoping that I can find it to forgive this person before I, I pass away. But as of right now, I don't really see that. But God knows that I would like to try to forgive this person, but does not mean I have to say anything to this person, but I'm not going to get deep into that the second one loser fell to now the third one he has married my mother before the person who gave you know help my mother give birth pretty much that's all he did um the third one he married her like i said before that one but he has stepped in and did the father role. He was a darn good father to me. He um, did all he could. He spent time with me. He loved me, but he passed away. And he will always have a special place in my heart because he was my sibling's biological father, except for my brother, one of my brothers. But he um, took on a father role to me and, you know, really wasn't much of a difference there except for he just wasn't my biological and you don't have to be a biological father to be a father a good father to someone either my husband is a good father figure to my son although my son's father is active in his life my husband still is a good father figure to my son and you know my sister's husband is a good father to her her son so you don't have to be a biological father to be a father to someone so if people who didn't actually make the person could be a good father so can the people who made the person and remember that 
try to be the best father you can be. God bless.